What's going on YouTube? It is your boy Thomas. And today we're looking at the Supreme at week five partial drop list, some sleeper items, box locos and more. Let's get into it. Sup Thomas. So we can see the overall drop list. I think there's actually some pretty cool pieces that we're going to talk about today releasing, including the Umbro soccer jersey, inside out BOGO, and even the painter's shirt. But let's talk about the first item here, the Taurus Varsity Jacket. It's got a very in-your-face, fuck em, I love New York design here. Statue of Liberty holding a Supreme S. And this is a Varsity logo kind of design or a varsity jacket design so it's got that wool outside that fuzzy material keeps you warm and the inside it's that sleek satin soft interior two colors we got the black and white and the lakers color which i don't know why you'd wear a lakers color if you're repping new york but hey that's what supreme decided to go with large supreme kind of old english s right there Supreme New York City 1994, the 94 and the infinity sign on the left arm. Pretty interesting. And that'll run you a clean 400 bucks. Next up, we got the very expensive $700 shot leather jacket, the racer style. I do really love this leather jacket. Looking at it, you can't really tell it's Supreme at all. Maybe that's a plus to some people. Small embossed logo right there on the left breast pocket underneath the pocket got some zippers on the pockets here pretty nice leather jacket really can't go wrong with it except it is very expensive so if you guys are copping shit i might need to uh, start a patreon or something because holy cow 700 bucks definitely not fucking around with this piece would love to see some some fits with this but yeah definitely pretty expensive but nice and classy you know shot has collabed with supreme many times so hey it's uh, it's definitely a jacket here we go inside out box logo covered this in my video yesterday be sure to check that out there and subscribe and like the channel guys on our way to 1000 subscribers so yeah thank you for the support but yeah the inside out box logo we talked about it yesterday like i said but if you haven't seen it yet for some reason well here it is it looks like truly an inside out logo because that's what it is it's printed on the inside the outside has this kind of blurry fuzziness to it. I still think these will sell out, but I know a lot of people aren't feeling them like a traditional box logo, understandably. It is screen printed. It's not embroidered on there. It is that brushed back fleece on the logo. So definitely not for everybody, but we do have four colors coming out. I think the black, maybe the olive are ones to go for or the gray i think the red is you know not really advisable but i really couldn't tell you which one is going to sell the best i don't think these are going to go for a ton over retail but i still think they'll sell out that's my prediction still think it's a safe bet because it is a box logo at the end of the day next up we have the reversed hooded sweatshirt if you were to look into a mirror maybe this would come out the right way i still don't think so because it is flipped like that i don't really know how mirrors even work though so who knows <laughs> who knows what this looks like we could bring this into photoshop okay so we're gonna take this and flip it horizontal so it still doesn't look the right way even mirrored because if you can see there it's still flipped the wrong way it's just reversed so you know, it's a little bit of a weird design. I don't think it's great, to be honest, especially not for 160 bucks. But if you like it, it's there for you. Like so many items releasing from Supreme, we have some hits, we have some misses. This one, in my opinion, eh, could go without it. All right, next up, the denim painter shirt. Kind of a sleeper item, in my opinion. I do actually really like it. It is 150 bucks, but... If you're into a more of a, just a denim casual Supreme shirt, this is definitely a piece for you. It's got that unique little grip on the side right there, the little loop, I think the hammer loop, utility pockets for all your paint brushes and such. Get your Bob Ross on in the denim painter shirt. 
I do love the classic blue denim. Black is not bad either. I could definitely see the black one selling out. Same with the blue. Don't think the white or the red are the move, but you know, this is a nice little sleeper piece. I do also love the Supreme logo right there is black and yellow. Just a little bit different. Very clean. Can't complain with an all cotton denim shirt. Next up, we have the scarf sweater featuring Belgium and France. So if you're a soccer fan, hey, you got yourself a nice little scarf sweater. Should say football, right? For the European listeners, viewers, and such. But yeah, pretty nice standard little supreme sweater. Sweater, 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 sweater supreme. More soccer stuff here with the Umbro Jacquard animal prints, and it does come with shorts as well. I really love the tiger design on this. It actually looks like tiger fur. If you look closely at the screen print, it has these little lines coming off on each of the black accents right there. You can see right there. It makes it almost look textured. Like I thought this was fleece at first, but you can tell upon closer inspection, it is like a polyester jersey material. I think this will sell out maybe after a few hours, maybe instantly. Kind of lost it right there because Supreme always does have a little soccer subculture. People that love to cop the soccer stuff, especially with the matching outfit. It is pretty cool. So dig this piece a lot, especially that it's a matching set. It is though 220 bucks if you want both of them. But there you go. Supreme Umbro. Very cool. Very nice. I like it. Next up, we have the patchwork jacquard long sleeve top. And I think this is another sleeper piece. We have all these super unique fabrics right here. The $1 bills, Supreme, the roses, schizo. Whoa there, two different colors. And if you guys have been following Supreme for a little bit, you'll know that these uh, patchwork designs usually do pretty well over the long term if you look on StockX or eBay of the previous jackets, anoraks, sweaters, they always do pretty well because they're a very cut and sew garment. It's definitely better than a just lazy screen printed box logo or whatever. It actually is a pretty cool piece. And for 120 bucks, it's actually one of the cheaper upper garments that's releasing this week. Hey, take a chance on it. Maybe it's for you, maybe it's not, but I actually really like this design. Patchwork jacquard long sleeve. Then we got the pretty classic, just pocket tee. Bunch of colors, won't sell out. Two different camo tones. What is it, 60 bucks? You know, add another pocket tee to your collection if you want it. It's there for you. Classic logo right there. Nothing really too much else to say about this cotton embroidered logo, eh? Then we got some hats right here. This is the reflective stitch camp cap. I believe this is a 3M material there. So that's pretty cool. Got some unique colors, really not too much else to say. Clip on the back or the, I guess, a buckle back. So that's kind of cool. Don't think really any of these colors will sell out. Really any of the hats this week aren't that great. This is probably one of the worst designs of the year. I don't know if I did a worst pieces of uh, spring, summer 2023, but this hat would definitely be on that list if I were to make that video because it's just uh, very uh, ugly in my opinion. We do have the visor uh, six panel right here. I actually do like this design split, I guess, design on the brim in the hat right there, the upper. Pretty cool design, I like it a lot. It's got some cool colors, like the acid yellow right there. Nice embroidered stitching on these. I think these are 60 bucks, no, 48 bucks. So not bad for the hats right there. Definitely think this is the best hat releasing this week. A couple more items, we have a matching scarf beanie for the sweater, same colors, 40 bucks. Don't think it'll sell out. It's there if you want it. And finally, the Candy Hearts skateboard, a little late for Valentine's Day, maybe right in time for Easter. But yeah, three colors, skateboard, 60 bucks. You know, don't think that will sell out. And then finally, we do have the unfeatured in the, in the preview, the Supreme Duralast mugs. I think these are glass in two colors. So I think you might get two for 58. I would hope so. 
but yeah supreme mugs for the accessory what do you guys think of the drop list this week i think it's a pretty middle of the road drop in my opinion i could definitely see skipping this week items i would go for would be the inside out box logo the jacquard patchwork long sleeve maybe the umbro soccer jersey or the denim painter shirt but that's gonna do it for the week guys hope y'all enjoyed it's been your boy thomas and i'm out peace